Good morning. Welcome to our morning devotion. Glad you are tuned to the morning encounter. It is our prayer that you will encounter with God through this broadcast. And now, let's welcome the servant of God. Good morning, viewer, and praise the Lord. Uh, this is the day that the Lord has made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. Uh, it's my pleasure to actually bring you the word of God throughout this week. My name is Pastor Patrick Kiprop, and uh, I welcome you to our morning encounter throughout this week. Uh, throughout this week, we're going to do an encouragement from the word of God on the topic, the heavenly wisdom versus the earthly wisdom. There are two kinds of wisdom which we find in the word of God and that we find in the book of James chapter 3 from verses 13 all the way to verses 18. James talks and writes about two kinds of wisdom. The first wisdom which James writes about is about the wisdom that is of the world. Uh, James talks about this kind of wisdom and says that this kind of wisdom is earthly, it is devilish, and it is characterized by a, a certain kind of behavior or a lifestyle which is sinful, which is impure, which is ungodly. On the other hand, David, uh, uh, James, sorry, actually tells us about the heavenly wisdom which he says that this kind of wisdom is pure, is holy and actually does not seek its own good. So we're going to look at these two types of wisdom which the, the first one as I've said is earthly and the second one is heavenly. Why is this wisdom uh, that is heavenly referred to be that of God? Because it, is, it does not come from within us. It does not seek to achieve our own will. It does not seek to achieve anything that is not of God. First of all, this wisdom helps us to live our, have our earthly lives in the perspective of achieving heavenly goals. Anytime we walk in the wisdom that comes from God, we do not seek our own. We seek that which honors God. We do not seek to, uh, to glorify ourselves, but we seek to glorify God. So that is the difference that actually is there between the wisdom of the world and the wisdom that is from God. James says that as brothers, we should not seek the things that do not honor God. Many a times we would like the praise of people, we would like people celebrating us, we would like to please people. However, as much that is good, then uh, that is not all about in life. Life is about living our lives here on earth in the perspective of our heavenly heritage. We should live and do anything we do today in the wisdom that is from above. In the word of God, when we read in the book of Matthew, chapter 25, from verses 1 to verses 13, we will see about the story of the uh, ten uh, virgins. The Bible talks of five of them being wise and five of them were foolish. And throughout this week, we shall be looking at how and what were the differences between the five who are wise and the five who are foolish. I pray that throughout this week, the wisdom of God shall come upon your heart. The wisdom of God, which is heavenly, shall be in your heart. And you shall learn how to walk as the wise, be as a wise person. And the wisdom that you're working with is the wisdom that is from above. It is my prayer today that indeed, throughout this week, the grace of God shall be sufficient for you. I want to pray with us even as we begin throughout the, uh, our morning encounter today and throughout this week that your days will never remain the same. Let us pray. Our Heavenly Father, we want to say thank you so much because uh, you are the Lord God who gives us wisdom. The, you, the Word of God says that, Lord, if anybody lacks wisdom, let him seek, let him pray, and you shall give us wisdom. I pray for my viewer, Lord, that throughout this week, we shall be edified, we shall be built, we shall be encouraged 
even to uh, to walk in the wisdom uh, that is coming from above. May you bless us, Lord, because we ask you this in Jesus' name. The Lord bless you, my viewer. Let's meet again tomorrow at this time through this particular medium. The Lord bless you. That was the morning encounter. We are glad that you tuned in. Follow us on YouTube at Sidim Eldora TV. Our Facebook page is Sidim Eldora. Our Twitter and Instagram handles at Sidim Eldora. And our website is eldora.sidim.org. Let's encounter again tomorrow morning, same time, same place.